few videos back, I was talking about relationships, and I said that if I was ever in or not in a relationship, it was frankly none of your business, and that I've never ever said in a video if I'm in a relationship or if I'm single or whatever. But I have decided that because I've gotten such positive feedback from that video, I'm going to tell you what's what. Now this is awkward for me because short of Facebook, I've never posted my relationship status and this is YouTube and this can be seen by anyone and ah. All right, I'm just gonna come out and say it. I have a girlfriend. There you go, that's a thing. I have a girlfriend. I have a girlfriend. Now yes, I did say that my relationship status is none of your business, but I have decided that since it's my channel and my relationship, our relationship, hers and mine, we figured that expressing it on YouTube would be apropos. Appropriate. So who is this lady? Well, she's standing right there. But first, I'm going to tell you a few things about her. Yes, I am. She loves reading, which is such a hard trait to find in people nowadays. I love reading, I just lack the time to be able to read as much as I want, but she reads all the time. She is one of the smartest girls I have ever met, and she's always trying to better herself, and by relation, it makes me always want to better myself as well. She's incredibly talented, and she sticks up for what she believes in, and she's just amazing. Oh, and she's sort of gorgeous, so I tell her all the time that she's out of my league. Yes, you are. Now the thing is, is that it's a long distance relationship, and long distance relationships by themselves themselves are hard, but she doesn't even own a laptop and we barely ever get to talk. And now the moment you have been waiting for, come on, no, come on, come on, my girlfriend. Don't glare at me. Obviously, as you can tell, this has all been an April Fool's ruse. An April Fool's ruse. Ruse, ruse, ruse. Hermione and I aren't actually in a relationship. We're testing the waters, we'll see where it goes, but, you know, we're going slow. And it takes a while to communicate by owl. Right, sweetie? But here's the very important thing. I don't want you commenting down below about how this is an April Fool's joke or anything. That is the biggest pitfall to a YouTube April Fool's Day video. Go down below, congratulate me on my new girlfriend. Say whatever you want, but don't say that it's an April Fool's joke because there are a lot of people who go to a video and while it's loading, they will read the comments. And you don't want it to be ruined for anyone else if it wasn't ruined for you. And if you see anyone down below saying, oh, this is an April Fool's joke or good one, Travis, you're really fool me. Go thumbs them down or click the spam thing or something. I'll get to deleting their comments or whatever. We need to make this seem legit so people don't realize until right then that it was a joke. Hope you guys have a good April Fool's Day. Don't pick up any quarters off the ground. They might be glued there. That's one that I did a couple years ago. It was hilarious. All right, bye.